am back and my lipstick is gone. We are going to be trying out these swirl and stripe balms from my little pony. My little Really? This is why, Kristoff. I don't know which ones are going to be striped, but I'm assuming that the Twilight Sparkle one is swirled and the Pinkie Pie one is striped because the picture's on the box. Let's open this up, shall we? They better not make this complicated to open. Melanta. All right. Da, 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 da. Da, da, da. We're going to take out the little tin box, which is so cute. It's got the pony crew on the front and Rainbow Dash, Twilight Sparkle, and Pinkie Pie on the back. I'm going to open it just to see if there's anything in it, which there probably isn't. Nope. It is an empty tin can, which I feel like I can use this for something besides the lip balms. But here are the four lip balms. We have Rainbow Dash, which is cotton candy flavored. We have Twilight Sparkle, which is grape flavored. Applejack, which is berry flavored. And Pinkie Pie, which obviously is bubblegum flavored. Gotta love Pinkie Pie. All right, which one am I gonna try first? Let's try, can't even pick them up. Twilight Sparkle. There she is. This is grape flavored, so we're gonna do a smell test and we're gonna do a lip test. Ooh, look at the inside. All right, I see you. Okay, it is definitely swirled. Oh, wow. It smells like grape pixie stick powder. It smells like the powder or sweet tarts. It also smells like sweet tarts. All right, let's try it. Hopefully it works. Hmm. 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 Nah. It's a little dry. Tastes like wax. And it smells like grape, which is awesome, but it's dry. I don't know if it's my lips or not. Like, I know it's not supposed to have a tint, but it feels really sticky and it doesn't glide on smooth at all. I don't know if I would use these on a regular basis. But I'm keeping them in my collection because it's My Little Pony. Put it in the box. The next one I'm gonna try is Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash. Cotton candy, which I love. And that is what it looks like on the inside. Very appropriate for Rainbow Dash. Okay, there it is. I was like, I can barely smell the cotton candy, but it smells like cotton candy once you get a whiff of it. You have to like literally put this in your nose in order to smell it. And it's barely there. <sighs> I have to like open my nostrils <laughs> and sniff this. All right, let's test it out. Oh, this one's even worse than the first one. Mmm. I bet it's my lips because I just wiped it with a makeup remover. Ah. Mmm. I don't know if you can see this, but watch. You see that? <laughs> it's so sticky! But it smells good. Okay, I can't even get it down now. We're struggling, folks. I mean, how much were these? $4 for the everything, and it comes with a tin? Well, it's going in the tin with Twilight Sparkle. Next is Applejack. This is a berry flavored. I was kind of hoping it'd be apple flavored, but whatever. And these colors are definitely appropriate <laughs> and perfect for the colors of the ponies, I'm, I will say that. This is even worse than the cotton candy! If you're gonna, okay, I can smell it, but again, you have to like literally open up your nostrils and smell it. It's barely there, but what I can smell, it smells like berry. Okay, it's not the makeup remover wipe. Ooh! But this one smells better once you put it on. It definitely smells better, but it's still so sticky. It definitely smells good once it's on your lips, but as far as a chapstick or balm, oh, I dropped it. Uh, not really good, but good for keeping in a collection so that you can tell your, oh no, I just squished the paper on the thing. Whatever. Applejack's going in the tin. Last but not least, Da, 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 da. Pinkie Pie, she's my favorite pony. Hers is bubblegum flavored, which I could see hers being cotton candy flavored too. And it is striped. Cute colors, perfect for Pinkie Pie. Let's smell it. 
Definitely smells like bubble gum better than the berry and the cotton candy. Kind of smells like, what was Twilight Spark? Grape. It kind of smells like grape. Hold on. The bubblegum one smells like the grape one. Doesn't smell like berry. I can definitely t uh, smell the difference in that one. Cotton candy, bubblegum. Okay, I can smell the difference. I was wrong. I just wanted to double check. <laughs> Let's try it. This one's definitely s smoother. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, okay, I can smell it better once it's on the lips. But I really gotta like cake it on. Maybe that was my problem. I gotta like get past that first layer of lip balm. I just gotta use a lot. We have two swirled and two striped. Can you see barely the difference? They all smell good together. <laughs> So I'm learning that you can use these and they're pretty okay if you use like a big thick layer. But overall, for kids, I think these are great. But if you're trying to use a chapstick to keep your lips healthy and hydrated, don't use these, just keep them for your collection like me. There you go, there is the review on the My Little Pony lip balms that come with a tin, so cute. But now we go to last but not least, <laughs> the nail polishes. I'm not quite sure how this is going to work, but let's open it real quick. And see, I, I searched for a while to make sure that I got all of them. They're definitely smaller once you take them out. And the little plastic on the nail polish, like the labels, are already like bubbling off. So here is Rainbow Dash. And then here is Twilight Sparkle. Very small and very cute. Perfect for kids. <laughs> Great for people collecting them too. It says here, do not recommend for children under three, avoid eye contact and do not ingest. Okay. It is made by a company called townlygirl.com and it doesn't say whether or not these are cruelty free. Directions, under adult supervision, apply to clean nails. Townlygirl.com and it has all of her information. These nail polishes will expire in 12 months. I didn't realize they were gonna do that. And they're each point 13 fluid ounces when it was a dollar for <laughs> both of these so what i'm going to do now is change the camera angle so you can see me apply the nail polish and also excuse my nails i gotta get them manicured they're really nasty anyway i'll be right back Ow! i've never done this angle before but we're gonna do the twilight sparkle one first so let's open it up it's got a very thick <laughs> little wand it smells like nail polish so let's try it out and see how many coats i'm gonna need all right oh okay that's not bad at all that's cute i was not expecting that great of color from dollar nail polish look at that that's one coat i am impressed so it looks like it's gonna take a couple of coats but man i'm really really impressed with that we're gonna try the rainbow dash red which it's not like a super bright red it looks more like a cranberry red or something like that but all right so here it is and we're gonna try it out on this nail Ooh, look at that Wow, I am thoroughly, thoroughly impressed. This is good quality. Good job, Townley. Whatever your name is, it smells like paint more than nail polish, but look, that coverage was way better than the Twilight Sparkle one. I am trying to keep this. There we go. It is way better coverage than the Twilight Sparkle one, as you can see. But yes, I really like those. Wow, I'm really impressed. I might just use up the bottles. <laughs> like, how fast does it dry? Oh, it's already dry. I'm like, I can put a second coat on the Twilight Sparkle one now. Let's see what it looks like with the second coat real quick. 
Okay, so it definitely dries a lot darker. Which is a little weird. But man, that's some thick nail polish. I'm really impressed. It's kind of streaky though. Maybe that's the only complaint. So I do have one complaint that it's very streaky. So it's kind of hard to put the second coat on. Let me put a second coat on the Rainbow Dash one. So I feel like it's dried enough. Yeah, it definitely dries darker. You can tell. Oops, I messed up a little bit, but that's okay. Oh my God, look at that. I'm really impressed. Honestly, look at that. Dollar nail polish. Especially if you want to get something for kids. Like, dude, that's really good polish. Oh wow, my camera angle got really bad. <laughs> well anyway, going back to the nail polish real quick. It looks like, ooh, it is already chipped. <laughs> But then again, I didn't put a base coat on, I didn't put a top coat on, and this is what the nails look like. The, oh, I gotta be careful. <laughs> the purple one will need at least three or four coats. I wanna say three. This one, excuse my finger, I should not have done the middle finger, what was I thinking? <laughs> the red one, as you can see here, only needs two coats, and it dried super fast, so I'm very, very, for kids nail polish, this is really good. <laughs> Not gonna lie. But that is it for the My Little Pony haul that I have. I'm definitely gonna have more to unbox for you guys in the future. And I wanna show you more of my collection soon as well. I really hope you enjoyed this. And if you did, please leave it a like to let me know that you wanna see more of this stuff in the future or any other unboxing subscriptions, whatever kind of unboxing stuff you want me to do. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up so I know you wanna see more of this in the future. I'm also going to be doing some cosplay series on this channel as well. I'm bringing gaming back on my channel. So if you have any suggestions on games or any challenges or any type of content you wanna see on this channel, please let me know and I will do my best to help you out with that. Love you guys so much, you're awesome, and always remember that life is a beautiful tangled mess and it is our job to make the most out of what we have been dealt with in life and make it the best time of our lives. You guys are awesome, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys, bye, 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 bye.